Can you tell me one thing that everyone is running after? Money. Money that you have earned through hard work. But everyone around you is running after wealth too. A bad guy can take it from you, you, or even you. So do you want to keep it safe? Do you want to have the satisfaction that your money is safe from the outside world? No one can come and get your money if it's in a bank. But what about your credit cards? Do you believe they are as secure as they say? You are probably thinking of someone stealing your PIN code when you pay for your groceries can get hold of your money. Actually, they can do much worse than that. Tap and pay might be convenient, but it is not as secure as you think it is. Let me tell you how tap and pay works. There is a tiny chip inside your credit card called an RFID tag, an acronym for Radio Frequency Identification. See that propagating wave sign and the pay pass on your card? It shows that it has an RFID tag embedded in it. This backscatter the radio frequency sent by the reader. That's the device on which you tap your card. These tags are not powerful enough for complex computation. Backscattering is the only thing they can do. We cannot implement complex security protocols on these machines. And they can easily leak information to any eavesdropper. Even if there are no eaves, how can you make sure that the reader is the legitimate? Anyone can send a query and the tag in your call will response. And you, are, you can be deprived of a huge amount of money without being known that your card has been charged. That's what my research is about, making RFID systems secure and invulnerable to the thieves. Now, what do you do when you want to make sure that no one else can interpret the confidential information that you're sharing with the trusted system? You set a code word or a key that only you and the authorized party knows. For example, Alice and Bob are communicating with each other and Eves want to listen to their private conversation. But he's unaware of the key, so he cannot extract the original messages from the encoded ones. We can apply the same methodology to the radio RF and the reader side to make the secure communication between them. By sharing the key through a secure channel and then transmitting the actual information over the invulnerable channel by encoding them. I don't want to take away the accessibility of using tap and pay from you. I just want to make sure that the next time you use it, you feel confident enough. Thank you.